Hey, what is up, bro? My name is Riso, aka the Wolf, and welcome to the Wolf Den. Okay, so for today's video, we're gonna be reacting to the new State of Play that came out on March 9th. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to catch this live because I was on a little vacation, but here we are. Okay, let's jump over to the reaction screen. There isn't really anything on the forefront of my mind that I really want to see here, except for I want to hear anything about Hogwarts Legacy. I am a huge Harry Potter fan, and so is my girlfriend, so if we can get any information on the game, I'm gonna be super freaking hype. Huh, you look at that. A PS5. Hello, yeah, viewers. it just reminds me of what I want, and where it literally, probably the year 2042 is when I'll be able to get a PS5 without having to stress about whether or not it's actively available, easily available. Updates for some fan favorites launching oh, soon. Oh, I heard about this Ghostwire game. It's supposed to be really freaky. <laughs> Ooh, y'all see that block? Skyrim? I just the hands. I know it's not a Skyrim thing, but sorry. I mean, I know it's not just a Skyrim thing. It's not just a scary game. It looks like they're gonna throw in some story in there, which could be good. Could be really good. The gameplay looks fun though. The, the enemies and oh my gosh, that's why I want to play it. Like, look at that. Look at that gameplay and the freaky enemies. That's why I want to play it. Ooh, getting um, dying light vibes, kind of too. The parkour. Ooh, look at that magic! Dude, this game looks hype! This game actually looks really, really hype. Oh, what Spidey? We got some Spidey action too. Let's go, baby! That actually looks pretty hype. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm actually really looking forward to that game. March 25th? <sighs> ah! <laughs> I can't believe this is coming across as a bad thing, but there's too many games coming out! Ah. It's okay, we'll figure it out. We'll make it work. Ooh! Ooh! I love- I love- You guys know I'm like a sucker for- Was that Final Fantasy, bro? Is that actually the Final Fantasy? It's just a Fantasy, it is! Dude, this game comes out in like two, three days! Oh, shoot, bro! Oh, you know we're gonna play this! Ah, oh, you know we're gonna play that! I am so hyped! March 18th? You guys when it releases? New demo available today. Okay, yeah. Oh, it's crazy! Later today, visit PlayStation Store to download a new demo for Stranger of Paradise, I mean, I don't need Final Fantasy Origin. I'm just gonna jump into the game, baby. Now, let's jump into the world of Forspoken, Forspoken with some all new gameplay. Is that another? No, I was gonna say it's another Square Enix game, but I don't think so. I don't think so. Beautiful. That could be wrong. There's yeah. no. It's another. Oh, it is. Everything here wants to kill you, kind of. Way. It is the one I'm thinking about. It is. It is. It is. Oh, the giant dragon baby. Hello. You know I'm a world changer. The music. I'm vibing. Oh, that was. That looks so cool, actually. She got yeeted by a dragon. Oh, that's cool. Oh, massive open world, baby. Massive open world. Oh, wow. Okay, okay. I'm vibing with the music, baby. Square Enix games, dude. All right, all right. I'm, I'm, I'm vibing, dude. I'm feeling it. Let's go. That looked cool. That looked so cool. Oh, wow. That looks awesome. Hello. Hello. Oh, you're killing me with the magic, dude. You're killing me with the visuals, baby. Let's finish this. Ah, oh, man, you got me sold. What is this coming? What is this coming? Please tell me it's gonna take a little bit. I've got too many games on my plate right now, baby. Forspoken. When is it coming out? Give me a release date. Oh shoot! That's gonna be. That is actually gonna be the day after my birthday and Sadie and I's four year anniversary. Wow. That's cool, dude. That is really, really cool. Ha <laughs> ha. 
Probably also means I won't be able to play on the release date because I'm going to be with my girl, but that is still so cool. It's almost time to sign off, but before we do, let's get a first look at two brand new games coming from Square Enix. I love Square Enix games. Let's get it. Since the Empire's main okay. Game. I was expecting some Octopath Traveler Every slash Triangle Strategy kind of look. Comes ashore. But this Focus. looks good. On, oh, you're giving me some... Okay. I can't really say Fire really Emblem, more like XCOM type. I can't comprehend it. Oh man, oh that's gonna be so cool, dude. Oh, that's gonna be so cool. Fuel Field Chronicle. Alright, alright, I'll put that on the list. I'll put that on the list. No, let's go on this game, baby. Let's get it. Let's get it. What you got for me, bruh? Oh. Okay. Okay. This is also looking pretty good. It's hack and slash goodness. Give it an RPG tone. Like, give me some level ups. Just give me some new moves. Here's my words. Give it a solid story, bro. And I'm, I'm sorry. It doesn't look that match. visually impressive, if I'm being honest. Like, it looks pretty. But after watching a game like Forspoken, which is also Square Enix title, which I know there's more things that go into it, but... It still looks like a game I want to try out. Maybe a game I probably, like, look at some reviews first, see what other people are saying about before I just instantly jump the gun to get it, but we'll see, we'll see. Because it does look really fun. It, it does look like one of those games that I would really be into. Valkyrie Elysium. Interesting. We'll have to see. We'll have to see where it goes. Okay, so what did I think of that state of the state of decay? State of play. <laughs> Initial reactions, I'd have to say, yeah, I mean I agree with everyone else. Pretty mid-tier. I mean, there's nothing anything super crazy that I'm like, oh I gotta pull my pants over. But no, let's put it a little bit above mid-tier. Cause like the Tokyo game like really stands out to me. It looks like it's gonna be freaky. It looks really pretty, and I'm very excited to try it out. Especially because it's coming out so soon. Another game, Force Spoken. That game looks so freaking hyped. I, I I'd say that's probably out of the, of the whole thing. Someone stands out most of my mind that I'm the most excited for. And again, the last two games at the end there looked interesting. They looked right up my alley. But am I gonna poop my pants over it? Not quite yet. We didn't hear anything about Hogwarts Legacy, which is such a big oof. Although I did look up to see if there's gonna be anything happening soon. I think. Two days from now, there's going to be a live where they're going to be just talking about Hogwarts Legacy. And I'm so freaking excited about that. So I guess we'll see what happens. In the meantime, why don't you all comment down below? What did you all think of this state of play? Are there any games that you are particularly excited for? And yeah, let me know. Are there any games that you all feel like you wish could have been in this state of play and you could have heard more about? What games did you want to see in this state of play? Anyways, on that will fact, thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to leave a like. Don't forget to leave a comment. And do not forget to subscribe to one of the most amazing YouTube families out here. And on that note, I love you, Wolfpack, and I will see you all next time. Stay video game hype, baby.